Welcome to the first in a series of instructional videos explaining how to successfully install the SolarEdge Home 48-volt battery. This video will show you how to safely unpack, mount, and secure the battery. Before we begin, please be advised that only properly trained technicians and SolarEdge certified personnel are allowed to install the SolarEdge Home 48-volt battery. It is also essential that you read the battery installation guide as well as all warnings and caution notes located on the battery before starting the process. In this video, we will demonstrate an installation of three batteries in two separate towers. Note that a single tower may accommodate up to three battery modules. The first tower will be built out of two batteries, and the second one will have one battery. Note that you can connect up to five batteries to one SolarEdge inverter. Prepare the installation tools. Note that the tools and some of the cables necessary for the installation must be provided by the installer. Now let's have a look what's in the battery package. The battery, a mounting bracket, two M5 screws, and lastly, an installation guide. Also, please note additional cables and accessories should be ordered separately from SolarEdge, according to the amount of batteries you'd wish to install. We're now ready to start. Our first step is to determine a suitable location for the battery installation. One that is leveled, can withstand the weight of the battery, and also takes into account local safety regulations and building codes. Please be advised that it is better to place the battery close to the inverter, and at a distance in which the connecting DC cables are no longer than 5 meters. The SolarEdge Home battery is both indoor and outdoor rated. If installed outdoors, we advise keeping it away from direct sunlight and extreme temperatures and weather conditions. Also, note the required clearance between the battery and other objects on the wall. Let's continue with unpacking the battery. Place the battery packaging in a convenient location. If possible, it should be in close proximity to where you will actually install the battery. Now, Go ahead and remove the external packaging. Use the handles to remove the battery from the package and place it close to the installation area. Then, take the wall mounting bracket and supplied screws out of the box. SolarEdge recommends installing the battery on a floor stand. Open the floor stand kit and place it close to the wall. Level the floor stand by adjusting the four legs. Use the pliers to hold the nut of each of the floor stand legs while turning the screw with a flat screwdriver. Once finished, turn the nut in order to close it and strengthen it with the pliers. Now place the battery on the leveled floor stand. Attach the vertical side of the wall mount against the wall and mark the drilling holes. Then move it away from the wall. Next, drill the holes and insert the wall plugs. Go ahead and secure the bracket to the wall. Then, tighten the two screws between the wall and the mount bracket, and the two screws mounted to the battery. For smoother cabling wiring, make sure to secure the wall bracket using the front edge of the oval holes. Now, remove the second battery from the package and place it on top of the battery you've mounted. Repeat the same mounting steps as for the first battery. The same goes for the third battery in a tower. Please note that the maximum allowed number of batteries in a tower is three. Once finished, don't attach the tower cover on the top of the tower yet. Let's move on to the second tower. The first step is to choose a suitable location with a minimum of 30 centimeters away from the first tower. Mounting should be done as demonstrated for the first tower. That's it. The two towers are ready for wiring. Join us for the next video in this series, where we will guide you through the SolarEdge Home 48-volt battery wiring process.